Oh, it's delicious. <laughs> hey. Hey. Jessica, sweetheart. You know I didn't mean to, right? I mean, you know, you know that I love you. I said, you know that I love you. I've got to get to work. Big day today. Oh, wish me luck. Rachel. I'm so glad you called. I need to talk to you about mom and dad's memorial. I'm leaving him. I gotta get Noah out of here. I can't take it anymore. What did he do? We're gonna come to you. Is that okay? Of course. Can you pick us up from the ferry? I think that we can be there before dark. One of my cases goes to trial today. I, I can order a ride share. No, it, I can... He's calling. Okay, call me back. Darling. Hey. You're home, right? Of course. Open the front door. I'm in the bedroom. I can wait. In other news, I seem to have forgotten my laptop. I can book a courier. Peter, it's beautiful. I'm, uh, I have to do better at supporting you. I just, you know, I get so protective and. It's okay, my love. I am, I am so in love with you. Do you think you can forgive me? There's nothing to forgive. You're amazing, you know that, right? All right, I'll be back in time for my laptop. my house key. Upstairs.
Darling? for me. Mrs. Howard? Is everything all right? I need to pick up Noah now. Sure. Uh, you just need to sign him out. No, I really don't have time to. What's going on? Well, we need to go. What happened? Mrs. Howard, uh, I've been meaning to discuss with you. I have quite an urgent situation. What situation? I don't have time to explain. I need to take him. Wait right here. And I need to go get the principal, okay? If, if you could just wait. Come on. But she said now. Come on. Mrs. Howard! We're gonna get on a train and then we're gonna catch a ferry to Aunt Rachel's house on Catalina Island. Mom! She's gonna meet us there. Mom, I'm trying to tell you something. Just, just wait. Noah. Dad's following us. How do you know? Dad and I share locations with each other. I need you to put your phone on airplane mode right now, baby. Moms and dads, sometimes they fight. What about my stuff? I can get you new stuff. What about my friends? Noah, do you trust me? Do you trust that I will always keep you safe and loved? Then we really need to get on the train and go to Aunt Rachel's Island. And you cannot call your father, okay? I understand. Okay. Call Jessica. This is Jessica. Can't take your call right now. Please leave a message. Call Noah. This is Noah. You know what to do.
God, you're okay. Welcome home. Living room is here. Um, bathroom is right back around there. Are you hungry? You should eat something. I couldn't. Noah? Are you hungry? Sweetie, you gotta eat something. Let me show you your room. So my ferry is at 7 a.m., so I will be gone by the crack of dawn. You commute into the city every day? Mm-hmm. And I'm out till late. This is you. I'll let you guys get settled. It's temporary. No, it's... It's fine. I promise you, I'll find you an amazing new bedroom and an amazing new house. Can I be on the beach? <laughs> I'll see what I can do. I know. Promise. This is you. No, I'm I'm not gonna take your room. I want you to. You need your space. You have no idea how much I appreciate this. I know, and it's fine. Stay as long as you want. I, I want you to know that I'm I'm on top of this. I will get a setup and out of your hair. There, there is no pressure. Why? You don't have to ask permission anymore. You're free. It's over. I don't know what I would have done without you. Here. Hold on one second. Arnica for the... Thought it might help Noah if you look like you. Called raccoons, Jessica. And they like trash. The heat of summer. Five new voicemails. Message from Peter Howard. You're gonna regret this. Message deleted. I've can't. 
canceled all your credit cards. Message deleted. I shouldn't have done that. I transferred 100,000 to your account. I'm sorry, I love you. Message deleted. <gasps> One voicemail from Peter Howard. I will find you. Where do you think you're going? Getting as far away from you as possible. You, you can't, Jess. You can't leave me. I, come on, I, I love you. I love you. Our sons. Both of you! Jess, do you understand? I, I love both of you so much. Look at me! If you ever leave me, I... <laughs> I don't know what I'd do. understand the request, but that's not going to work. Well, he can allege whatever he wants to allege, but that doesn't mean... No, I absolutely will not speak with Peter. And I am under no obligation to disclose her whereabouts. Well, there are a number of things we'd like to speak with the police about as well. So, Peter cut your credit. Yeah, and then sent me $100,000. It's textbook. That'll help. I don't want his money. I can make my own. Jessica. I don't care. Where's Noah? He wanted to explore the neighborhood. You know where? I think he said Descanso Overlook. He's safe here, you know. We're all safe. Peter doesn't even have my address. No, I, I know. I know. I just thought it would be nice to hang out with him. It's okay to be worried. You're right. I know it's a lot. You are my sister, and I love you. I'm happy to help. So, I wanted to tell you, I have this friend who's renting out this lovely little house down on the beach, and if you don't mind, and this is absolutely not a hint, but it's gonna go fast. So, I arranged for you to see it later today. That's amazing. You don't mind? Of course not. Great. She's also on the board of this cute little school in town, and she said they're desperate for substitute teachers. Did you just find me a house and a job in less than 24 hours? You should have me on retainer. Maybe I should. There's something interesting about the water too. There's a little cool in the pool and wide variety of fish. Let's see this little oh, This is okay. here. Noah. Hi. This is Corey. Miss Jordan's sister. I was just teaching your boy here about the riptides down there. Uh, I'm, hi. I'm Noah's mom. You are gonna be late, honey. What for? Best ways to ambush the fish and... Well, that sounds fun. Just trying to teach him about the history of I genuinely don't mean to be rude. You really need to go. Where are you going? I didn't mean to hold you up. Not at all. We really need to go. I need to go see a house that Aunt Rachel found, so come on. I wanna stay. It's on the beach. Hope you like the new house. See you, Corey. See ya. Mom, why aren't you great? Mom, no. Well, 
Oh, smile could really pay off for you right now. Might even be something awesome in it. Yeah. Mom! I want you to know I understand how hard this is for you. Is this our new home? Listen, you're gonna feel a lot of conflicting emotions right now, and that's okay. You're gonna be angry with me, angry with your father, and... I just wanna go home. Because sometimes it's not that simple. I hate him! No, Noah, he's still your father. Not after what he did to... Douchebags. Oh, you can see it comes fully furnished. Well, we just got here, so that's great. Is this for you and your family? Just me and my son. Oh, and it comes with this gorgeous kitchen. Oh, <laughs> we can get that fixed. Can you do 5,000 cash? Can you do first and last? Corey. Almost done. How do you like the house? It's great. I love it, Mom. Want to check out your room? <laughs> yeah, I don't know how that got there. Security camera up front. That's very kind. Miss Jordan asked me to. Thank you. Happy to help. The heat of summer is raging on. I'm all sweaty. I like it. But we're just getting warmed up. Is it hot in here? Whoa, Chase. This August. <laughs> LMN presents Sizzling Summer Nights. Oh, let's do this. Hot new movies every Thursday night. So. Oh, that's not a good sign. No problem. I'll have Corey fix that too. Here, shine your flashlight over here. Backup generator. And you'll definitely need that when the storms come. Oh, well, no one ever mentions storms. No, the whole island can lose power for days. <sighs> And I moved here, why? Because you have the greatest sister in the world who's moved heaven and earth to get you set up for the life you deserve. Greatest? Mm -hmm. You know that's me. Really? <laughs> You're gonna need a better flashlight, you know. Oh, and on my new phone, it's fine. New? Yeah, I set up new accounts. I saw that, Miss Jess. <laughs> here, fuse boxes over here. You're not the only. You are the greatest sister. That's where you'll flip the breakers back on. Okay, great. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, 
Um, I'm gonna go check on Noah. Hey, lights out was 30 minutes ago, Mr. Man. Can I finish this race? Five minutes. You have school tomorrow. Okay. And don't forget to brush. Sir, Logan P has entered the game. Hey, Logan, what's up? We just moved from the city, and we really like it here. I'm sure you and your son are going to love living on the island. This camp, and the senior class is in desperate need of your talents. <laughs> so if you email over your material list in case we're missing anything. Materials, <laughs> perfect. Okay. What's that? Overwatch chat room. What's that? Try one. You baked cookies? Why is that funny? So you cook now? I always cooked. Who breeds begs to differ? Oh, one. Mm. It's actually really good. Oh, actually, huh? It's actually really good. Can I have more? Take out the trash and maybe. How about you take the trash and I take these back to the kitchen? I want it on record that I will not always be this much of a pushover, okay? I'm gonna take out the garbage. So, Peter is threatening to file both a missing person report and a parental abduction report. He wants my address. Well, he's not gonna get it. That's why he's doing it. He's probably trying to get custody. He said that he would hunt me down. He said he would never let me go. Sweetie, he can't come near you. You're bound to be concerned with everything that's happened. I see it a lot. You do? I do. And to be honest, 
You're doing so much better than most of my clients. <sighs> That's reassuring. Good. Be reassured. And in the meantime, I want you to keep a log of anything that feels unusual. And remember that I filed the protection order so he can't come anywhere near you. And the security camera? Corey said he's replacing the system. Okay. You want to try my cookies? You bake now? So, Corita Kent was a nun? And one of the most influential artists in pop art. Sister Mary Corita, she combined Warhol, social justice. She's too cute to be a nun. <laughs> I don't think cute is in the criteria. You're too cute to be a teacher. <laughs> <laughs> Todd, one second. The objectification of women is not cute at all. It's problematic. It leads to shame, anxiety, and causes long-term psychological damage. Yeah, but that's not what I'm, I'm... And that's where the problem starts, Buster. I'm sorry, miss. It's okay. Well, that told him. <laughs> but they're never too young to learn some respect. Next door. Just thought I'd say hi. Hi, uh, Jessica, art history. You just moved into Esme's place, right? It's not creepy at all. Esme's my, my aunt. Oh, OK. <laughs> That's less creepy. I hope so. This, this town is small. Everyone knows everything. I get it. I grew up in Orange County. I grew up literally two streets from Esme's place. And you're still here. Walking there right now. If you want to tag along. Sure. Finally, where I'm supposed to be. I have all the family I need right here. We'll follow you wherever you lead us. I did all of this for you! We're gonna find her. New movies every weekend. Isn't that divine? Only on Lifetime. When you have big plumbing problems, you need soup. And then my parents passed away. So I moved to San Francisco, and my sister came here. Rachel Jordan, the lawyer. Everyone really? You OK? Yeah. Just look back a few times. Just remembering the way. The sea on your left. That's good to know. <laughs> Thank you. So have you been to the uh, Escanso Bluffs? The sunset's there. Stunning. I'd like to see that. I could arrange that. Are you sure you're OK? Sorry. Bring some food, wine, watch the sun go down. Sounds a lot like a date. Is that OK? Yeah, I, uh, I've been doing this online baking class. You have? It's called YouTube. <laughs> um, right now, I am mastering cookies. So there is a correct answer to this. Chocolate chip, peanut butter, oatmeal raisin. Um, chocolate chip, obviously. <laughs> That's correct. Now, you can use any rule. You can catch a wide variety of fish. How big? My favorite thing to do is to get down to the shoreline, and this rock here, you can throw a rock. Just teaching him how to fish. Yeah, I'd rather he stayed on top of homework. Mom, I'm fine. I've already done my homework. Inside? Please, Noah? You're so embarrassing. I'm just trying to be friendly, miss. You seem like a really nice man. Thank you. 
your work on the house. It's, it's great. He's ten. I'm just trying to be nice. I'm not trying to accuse you of anything or offend. Thank you for understanding. Give me five seconds. Okay. Noah! Noah! Oh, why are you writing my app? Oh, I dare you to say it. Are you upset that I am going out and I'm not going to be gone long? Aunt Rachel is going to stay with you. Babysitter. Yeah, well, your blossoming friendship with Captain Creepout suggests otherwise. His name isn't Captain Creepout. His name is Corey. Noah? He's my friend. Please, just find age-appropriate friends. I don't get why you care so much. Because I'm your mom, and I want you to have friends in your own age group. This is because of Dad. You told him? No, she doesn't have to tell me anything, but I have ears. Your father and I don't have anything to- He doesn't even care. He hasn't tried to call me once. That is actually a really good question. Look, I really need to talk to you. He's upset. You need to sit down. No, I just, he's really sit down. upset. Honestly, Rach, I have handled everything that man has thrown at me for over a decade. I can handle whatever he's throwing at me now. He's dead, Jess. I'm sorry. Peter is dead. When? Robert called. There was a car accident last Friday. Come on. Sit down. It's over, Jess. He's gone. He can't hurt you anymore. get the messages until after. There's no service up there. I'm so sorry. Is everything okay? I want to tell you about it. And one of these days I will. I just, um... Hey, you still want those cookies? Is Noah having a tough time with the move? Seems like a difficult adjustment. San Francisco, I'm here. He's pretty robust. Well, I can tell you're an amazing mom. I 
need you to leave. I'm sorry. Okay. Heat of summer's raging on. I'm all sweaty. I like it. But we're just getting warmed up. Is it hot in here? Whoa, Chase. This August. <laughs> LMN presents Sizzling Summer Nights. Oh, let's do this. Hot new movies every Thursday night. So you were snooping through his stuff? We have not been that bad. <laughs> really? Sizzling Summer Nights, Thursdays in August at 8 on LMN. For more than 50 years, Evergreen Health, your community-owned hospital, has grown alongside the families and district we serve. Really tough news tonight. No, he was the safest driver. I mean, we thought about it all the time. Do you want me to come over? No. No, it, it's late. You're right. For sure. Yeah. Sorry. You don't have to be sorry. Just, just try and get some rest, okay? Okay. I love you. Love you too. So this is going to be everything? Yes, these are all the newspapers from last weekend. This is the national newspaper? It is. The database on the computers over there have a searchable list of all major national and local newspapers. Will it cover the weekend? Right up until this morning.
Miss Lorna. Hi, Jessica. Can you come to the school? Something has happened to Noah. Who started this? The other boy said Noah did. We're trying to get to the bottom of what happened. Did you hit him? Noah said Brett stole his phone. Did he? Do you know why he stole your phone? Don't know. A number of the boys have been giving Noah a hard time. Why didn't you say anything? Sweetie. You've already been through enough. I am the one who protects you. Okay? I'm not. I went to the library today. Okay. Every single newspaper, Rach, every single one, said the body was unidentifiable. I read the coroner's report. You did? Of course I did. Well, what did it say? You don't want to know the details. I want exactly the details. Can you send it over? Jess. Rach? Okay, I will bring it over. You're the best. I know. Summer is raging on. I'm all sweaty. I like it. But we're just getting warmed up. Is it hot in here? Whoa, Chase. This August, <laughs> LMN presents Sizzling Summer Nights. Oh, let's do this. Hot new movies every Thursday night. So you were snooping through his stuff? We have been that bad. <laughs> really? Sizzling Summer Nights, Thursdays in August at 8 on LMN. For more than 50 years, Evergreen Health, your community-owned hospital, has grown alongside... So... Did you put this in the living room? No. Look me in the eye and tell me you didn't put this in the living room. I didn't, Mom. Okay. Okay. Noah, have you spoken to your father in your game chat, maybe? She told said he. She told you. caveat that I think you're doing amazingly. Did you bring the coroner's report? Have you thought about seeing someone for PTSD? I need to read it. I'll bring it tomorrow. I will. And I'll talk to my therapist about it. Thank you. <laughs> I 
I really am trying to be a bee, you know? It's beautiful here. And I've actually been feeling happy. I said it. You're doing amazingly. For Noah. Weird, Rach. I have to be honest, something just doesn't feel right. Mm. Noah has this, this new friend online, and what if it's really Peter? What is that? It's Noah. It is. I'm sure someone just found his. What is it? Pictures. You and Matt. What? It's you, Jess. Asleep. We need to call the police. Absolutely. But, but don't you think we should talk to Noah first? If someone is in my house. It's Noah's phone. What are you saying? Look, I know you've tried to protect him. I know you have, but... Hey, Logan, remember when I drifted into first place in front of Jared? Oh, that was so cool. And then remember when you jumped over the bridge? <laughs> that was so cool. so difficult. Okay, we, would, we would be so much happier. I will never let you leave me. Never. Summer's raging on. Go, Diane! Yeah, keep it going! Yeah, 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 yeah! Go, 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 honey! If you love them enough to drop... Whoa. Sorry. Uh. Uh. Sorry that I, um, I haven't... It's okay. I've been trying to talk. A lot going on. There's a, a Peter on the quad to see you. He says it's urgent. You okay? Jordan, I'm Angela Ford's father. The librarian. Yes, Peter. I want to talk to you about a possible vacation clash we have. So? I'm going to do this quickly. OK. My husband was abusive, physically, mentally. His threats, photos. What photos? Rachel, Noah. You. Me? Why? That's a good question. Someone has broken the lights outside of my house. I have found my security camera in the trash. Someone has been in my house first, in my garage, and then behind me in the kitchen. They took photos of me sleeping. You think it was him? 
obviously. But the San Francisco Police Department has notified Rachel that he, he was killed, though direct. My world is, is gone crazy, and I, I am feeling like I am losing my mind. So if this is some kind of weird game or joke or, or whatever to you, then I need you to stop. Are you actually asking me if I... I'm so sorry. I just... I don't, I don't know you very well, and I don't... I promise you, Jess, I would never do anything to hurt you. Ever. Or Noah. Okay. Thought we could have pizza for dinner? Watch a movie? Sweetheart. Yeah. I know that this is all very confusing. Are you making the pizza? Well, I have been experimenting with a sourdough pizza base. Can we order in? Noah! I'm sorry, Mom, but you're a terrible cook. I really am trying to get better. You don't need to. You're amazing. I should be saying, and I'm sorry, but I'm glad he's gone. He's still your father. He can't hurt you anymore. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I never wanted you to know. I really tried to protect you from it. I know you did. Why couldn't we do this at home? Homes, properties, assets, art. There's a new article that came out in San Jess. Okay. Okay, yeah, I'm crazy. No one thinks you're crazy. Just put it all in a trust for Noah. That would be about $30 million. Great. He can have 25% when he's 18, 25% when he's 21, and the rest when he turns 30. You should at least keep the country house. And you're entitled to child support. He said he would kill me, Rachel. He said if I ever... He's gone. He can't hurt you anymore. It is in this precise moment when everyone gives up on the crazy woman. Well, then that... it's a good thing no one's given up on you. Yeah. Sorry. I am acting like a crazy person. You okay? Could I walk you home later? Um. It's not entirely. Uh, I want to talk to you about Noah. Oh. He's been talking to me. Why? I don't know. I think maybe he needs a father figure. Or maybe he. Actually, have to deal with some legal stuff with Rachel after school. But maybe you could come over later? Really? Like nine? After Noah goes to sleep? See you then. Let's get this show on the road. Do it. Call Rachel Jordan. Look, about earlier, I didn't mean that. It doesn't matter. Are you okay? I got a letter. I think it's a threat okay? from Peter. I know he's alive. You need to get Noah. Come right over to my house. Do it now. 
Noah? Noah, baby? Jess. Noah? Jess. Jess. Noah? Get in a ride chair, come to my place. Noah! I'm so sorry, I couldn't go to sleep. And I can't lose you. I know you're not gonna lose me. If Matt hadn't have been there. That was blind luck. I was supposed to come over at nine. Then I tried to call you and came over. Are you okay? Are you? What happened? They went to Corey's house and he's been stealing from me for months. He had a bunch of my personal belongings and yours. He's been in and out of rehab, whole thing. I knew he was off. I'm so sorry. He could have hurt Noah. I just wanted to give a guy a chance, you know, and it's all a mess. What about Matt? Can he? I could sleep on the couch. He should stay. I'm happy to stay here. Yeah. Okay, well, I would just like to understand how this even happened in the first place, because to me, that is just completely unacceptable. Well, uh, but how does it even get to that point? How does someone be pronounced dead without it ever being confirmed? You okay? That is just completely unacceptable. Sit down. Just tell me. You were right. He was in the hospital in Oakland. He's been discharged, and they're investigating why it was considered a murder and not a missing person. Are you okay? It was him. He's on the island, and he's demanding to see Noah. I will not meet with that man, and my son will not meet with that- Who? What happened? Nothing. Something's happened. Hey, why don't we go get ready for school? Why do I have to go to- Because it's just better if we do. Are you gonna go? Of course I'm going. You're absolutely not going to work today. I'm not gonna stay here. Okay.
call Noah? This is Noah. You know what to do. Hey, sweetie. It's Mom. It's after four. Where are you? Call me back. Call Rachel. Hey, Jess. Hey, uh, is Noah at your house? No, he's probably at the beach. No, he, he would have told me. Especially after yesterday. Rach, he was supposed to come home right after school. I'm sure he'll come back. Don't worry about it. Okay. Call Yari. Hi, Jessica. Hey, um, no one ever came home after school. Do you know when he left? Naughty to do that. Mr. Howard is Noah's nothing. He is Noah's nothing, and you just helped that man kidnap my son. Jessica. Until a judge rules otherwise, Mr. Howard has every legal right to collect his son from school. Jess. Where are you? Lovely to hear your voice. Where the hell are you? Taking a hike with my son. It's been a long time. And I hear the Disconsol Cliffs puts on the loveliest sunset. Bring him home. Call Rachel. Hey. Rachel, he's, he's taking him to the cliffs. Oh, no. Okay, what, 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 what can we do? Very little without a court order. No. I'm going. You think that's a good idea? No, he, he knows that I went there with Matt, Rachel. There was a threat there, and I am not going to let him hurt my son. I'll meet you there. There's no way I'm letting you meet him alone. Let's get this show on the road. Noah? With me. Leave my son alone. Your son. Dad. Shut up! Don't talk to him like that. Let him go now. You look terrible. You know, I've always hated it when you wear your hair like that. Stop! Wow, look at how brave you both become. <laughs> if you weren't so mean all the time, maybe we wouldn't have left. We? Yeah! Noah, I think we know who the mean one is here, huh? Putting all this poison in. <laughs> wow. What has gotten into the two of you, huh? You leave home for a couple days, and now we're just bold. It's from dealing with you for a decade. Yeah. OK. Yeah. Yeah, it's me, right? And everything that you have put me through this past week, Corey. The garage of security cameras. I'm sorry. What are you talking about? He was in my house. He attacked me. He could have hurt Noah. How could you do that to us to him? Whoa. Wait, wait, wait. I, I had nothing to do with that, man. I, I... Station of the protection order here. Oh, great. Oh, isn't this just great? The whole family's here, kiddo. Isn't it all just so wholesome? Jess, can we just... Can we just talk? I have nothing to say to you. Nothing? I love you. I would do it. Anything, anything for you. And I just, I just, I, I, I don't understand. I don't understand how you could be so cold when all I want to do is put our family back together. You are cruel and abusive and dangerous. Look at what you're doing to our son. I should have divorced you years ago. You can't leave me, Jessica. You can't. Mom, go. No! You will never touch me again. You can't! Gonzo Bluffs. My sister just killed her husband. She just came up behind him and pushed him over the edge. 
Please hurry, I need help. What are you doing? You don't care. Not about me. Not really. You were out the first shot you got. You just left us for your bright, shiny new life. And then mom and dad were sick, and you don't even know how much that cost in the end. And then Adam left, and it was just radio silent. You could have asked me. I tried. And then how long was it before you got back to me? I was dealing with all of that stuff with Peter and I. I didn't know how hard it was for you. You didn't care. You have your job. They cut me loose. Said I wasn't a team player. I'll give you money. I have asked you for help so many times and nothing. And then all this happens and you have no idea what it's like to be looking into the face of financial ruin. Because your entire life, everyone's done everything for daddy's favorite girl. And you just take it all for granted. Me, Matt, Peter, please. If it's not just Jordan, you don't care. No one can ever work hard enough. It doesn't even matter. You just take whatever you want and leave. That's not Noah's legal guardian. You did all this all along. You, you paid Corey to tamper with Peter's car. You stole the phones. You sent the pictures, the letters, the posts. You, you manipulated Peter. You made that man to attack me in my home. I am your sister. The thing is, this is all going to point back to you. Please. Rachel, you, you, can, you can have all the money. Okay, you can. It's too late. I'll tell the police, Rachel. And you've been acting so erratic lately. Who do you think they're going to believe? Me. Great speech, by the way. Cops are gonna love it. Hold on, hold on. Hey, you, got it? you okay? Yeah. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you.